Well, what's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm gonna to be bringing you guys another short video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to get the FIB badge. But before we get into that, if you guys can see that my intro did not play, the, the reason is because most of my videos were copyright claimed for some reason. I don't know why, I thought, your, I thought music can play for like 30 seconds, but it's only 10 seconds long, I don't understand. It's been copyright claimed by the guy that made it, apparently. But yeah, so, now that, now that I just said that, so now we're just going to get into how to get the FIB badge. So first, you guys will just want to go over here to your setup board. I, I think, I think the big con does have it, but I'm doing the aggressive approach. So I'm just going to say this for the videos that you guys will just want to have the aggressive approach, which is the third, uh, select approach. So you guys will want to have that. And so after you guys do have that, you guys will just want to walk over here to your prep board and you guys will just want to start up where it just shows Lester's face right here. And so you guys will just want to click this. And so whenever you guys do load, you guys should be in a suit. And whenever you guys are in a suit, it'll take you to this place where you guys have the FIB badge. But yeah, so you guys can put this on any outfit that you want. So make sure you make sure you Make sure you do have the outfit that you want, that it's saved, and it's in your inventory. So as you guys can see, I do have the suit. But yeah, my arcade's like literally right next to this gun store. So you guys want to go to any gun store, whatever, whatever your arcade is next to. So I'm just going to go to this gun store over here. And so whenever you guys do get to the gun store, you guys will just want to watch what I do. Okay guys, so now that I am at the gun store, you guys will just want to walk in. You guys will want to walk to your right over here to these little jackets and it'll, it'll be your clothing and you guys will want to go to outfit saved and so it should be all your outfits and so you guys will just want to select the outfit so i'm going to choose this one slot five so i'm going to put it on and so you should have your outfit that you did save and that you want you guys will just want to select it and so now you guys will just want to go to strawberry avenue or wherever wherever it tells you to go and so once you guys get there, it'll have you take out these police officers and then you guys will just take the FIB badge. Okay guys, so whenever you guys are here, if you guys are on an oppressor or whatever you guys are on, you guys can just take these people out. And so once you take these people out, then you guys can just like take the FIB badge or whatever from the guy that has it. So as you guys can see right here, it shows a green dot on the map. You guys will just want to go to that guy, which I guess he's right here. Where's he at? Oh, okay. <laughs> Guess he's gonna be slumped over like that. But yeah, so you guys will just wanna grab it once these cars burn, or you guys can just do this. And so now it's gonna have now it's just gonna have you search for the FIB badge. So as you guys can see, I do have the FIB badge on. So it took off my vest, but th that's fine. I'll probably put it back on and it'll let me. But yeah, so after you guys do have the FIB badge badge on you guys will just want to go to a gun store it doesn't matter which ones as long as you guys do go to a gun store and you guys will just want to go to where you got your outfit last time and then this time you guys will just want to save it so so after you guys do save it or so once you after you do save it you guys can just finish the mission and then you guys can just save it so as you guys can see i'm gonna i'm just gonna save it to the slot that i wanted it and so i'm gonna save it and now i have the fib badge with this outfit and so now after you guys do have that, you guys can just finish the mission. So if you guys do want this outfit that I do have, I'll, I'll be showing you guys after I do this mission or after I do finish this mission. So I'll get back to you whenever I get to the clothing store. Now, if you guys did want to learn how to make this outfit, I'll be showing you guys right here. So you guys will have, you guys will have to do this for the diamond casino. I so guess we'll just want to go to the front counter, go to diamond casino outfits. And then you guys will just want to buy the group A sec gear which is on slot 20 and so you guys will just want to buy this the unbreakable and so once you guys do have that your outfit should look like this and so after your outfit does look like this you guys can just go over here to pants you guys can scroll down to jeans and you guys can just look for the the midnight camo fitted jeans my bad so once you guys go to jeans it's on slot 41 and it'll be the midnight camo fitted jeans so after you guys do have that, you guys can go over here to shoes. You guys will just wanna, 
you guys will just want to go to skate shoes and you guys will want to look for the two-tone skate shoes which is on slot 17 or you guys can do the all black skate shoes it doesn't matter whatever you guys like better but i'm just trying to make it match the top kind of and just like the other parts that are black on the outfit so yeah so after you guys do have that you guys will just want to walk over here you guys will just want to go to to hats and you guys will just want to go to bulletproof helmets which which is on slot 18 and buy the black bulletproof helmet so after you guys do have the black bulletproof helmet you guys will just want to go over here to accessories you guys will just want to go to cuffs and you guys will want to buy the spike to gauntlet for your right hand which is on slot 17 and scroll up all the way to slot 6 which is the the spike to gauntlet for your left arm so after you guys do have that you guys can go to gloves and then you guys can you guys can put on whatever gloves you want, but I prefer the black fingerless gloves because I just think it looks better. But yeah, so if you guys did do the glitch with the FIB badge, your outfit should your outfit should look like this. But yeah, I'll be showing you guys how to get the mask with the with the helmet. But yeah, the the vest that you guys saw earlier on the outfit it can't be uh, put on or else the FIB bat the FIB badge will disappear. But yeah, so. I'll, I'll just be showing you guys how to get the mask and the bulletproof helmet. Okay guys, so whenever we are at the mask store, you guys will just want to go to mask. And you guys will just want to scroll all the way down to ski mask. And you guys will want to buy the black tight ski mask, or black tight ski, which is on slot 79. And so after you guys do buy that, you guys will just want to walk over here to hats. And you guys will just want to buy the black bulletproof helmet, which you guys probably already bought at the clothing store. So yeah, yeah, you guys won't need to do the telescope glitch for this. It'll just combine the mask and helmet together. But yeah, if you guys want to get the FIB badge with this outfit, you guys can. If you guys already did it with another outfit and it's too late, you guys can just redo it. But yeah, so I hope you guys did enjoy this video. This is just a simple tutorial on how to get the FIB badge. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.